now iconic BMW Rondel has received five iterations since the birth of the brand more than a century ago. But have you ever wondered where the world-renowned propeller-looking logo first originated from? If so, stay tuned as we will explore the history behind this iconic logo. Back in 1917, BMW was actually renamed from an existing company called Rapp Motorenberg, and for the sake of simplicity, I will refer to them as RMW from now on. RMW was fundamentally the roots of BMW as we know today, since the company was established in 1913 and was led by a man in which the company was named after, Carl Rapp. RMW essentially focused on building and selling ICEs or internal combustion engines to various forms of aircrafts and motor vehicles. With the extra funding as well as a new supervisory figure in the name of Franz Josef Pop, RMW managed to quickly expand both its workforce and production facilities in order to cope with wartime orders. Pop at the time also made a critical transfer by bringing in a man called Max Frizz. Frizz was an aircraft designer and engineer at Daimler, and with his inputs, managed to improve the struggling engines under Carl Rapp's hands. This completely transcended the reputation of RMW, as they no longer produced engines that were unable to satisfy the demands of the German Air Force. With this breakthrough, the partners within RMW realised that they no longer needed Rapp, and concluded his contract. Essentially, this event caused Rapp Motorenberg to need a new name, as the man who the company was named after was no longer part of the company. Consequently, on the 21st of July 1917, Rapp Motorenberg was renamed to Bayerisch Motorenberg, aka BMW. There was no need for a logo during the early days of BMW, since the primary business evolved around selling and maintaining engines for the German Air Force. However, on October the 5th, 1917, the first version of the now historic BMW logo emerged. The new logo featured many similarities with the old Rapp Motorenberg logo, with a distinct black ring bearing the company name. What was different was the dash of gold, but more notably the inner circle which consisted of blue and white split into opposing quarter slices. The two colours weren't just randomly chosen, instead they paid homage to the state colours of the state of Bavaria, the home of BMW. While the two colours displayed the state colours of Bavaria, BMW couldn't quite adopt the same pattern as the local regulations at the time forbade the use of state colours or other symbols in any commercial application. As such, this is how the famous blue-white, blue-white logo was permitted, since it was displayed in the inverse order compared to the state colours. The story that the BMW logo resembles a propeller actually came directly from a BMW advert in 1929. The ad showed an airplane with the BMW logo embedded on the spinning propeller. This photo perfectly encapsulated what BMW was trying to promote at the time as it reflected the foundation and know-how of BMW in aircraft engineering. This legacy was further reiterated in 1942 when BMW released an article in the publication Aircraft Engine News, which showcased a picture of the BMW logo suffused over the rotating propeller. For a long time, BMW made little effort to correct the myth that the BMW badge is a propeller, says Fred Jacobs. With that and a constant repetition over the past 90 years, the propeller tradition has firmly remained. As the BMW logo evolved over the years, the distinct trademarks of the BMW emblem are still very much prominent, with only subtle changes to the logo done to make it more relevant for the time frame it was in. Fast forward 103 years later, a new and polarizing logo has emerged. The new communication logo radiates openness and clarity, describes Jens Thieme. This new logo will be used for BMW brand communications in the future, with the goal to not only embrace the opportunities of digitalization, but also to better place BMW to tackle the challenges that it brings. For those that love the classic BMW logo, fear not, the new logo will only be used for brand communication purposes, with the logo from 1997 still embodying your shiny new BMW.